<laughs> Raz, what did the coach mean? Well, see, there was this one time I tried to uh, take over the world. And I got some help from a dentist slash brain surgeon. Slash lunatic. Everybody, shh. <laughs> what? No one can hear us. Yeah, but I'm just a little freaked out. Where is he? What was that? <gasps> Hello? What the? <laughs> Dr. Lobato! Hey, have I seen you somewhere before? No. Uh, because if you're a new patient, then there is a lot of paperwork you'll need to fill out. Didn't you... weren't you... the coach? Oh, listen, I'd appreciate if you didn't tell that little army man about my second job. As a freelance contractor, I do find the need to... <laughs> Juggle clients from time to time. But I don't think he would like hearing that I was moonlighting. Just between you and me, I think that little fellow had a touch of halitosis. Am I right? But the customer is always right. And it's not like doesn't have his own issues. New client? Who's that? Aha, nice try. Doctor, patient, confidentiality is something I hold dear. I'd be nothing without my professional ethics. Now, sit back, relax, and this icky procedure will be over in no time. Procedure? I'll be gentle. I have to. I get a bonus if I deliver your brain in one piece. <laughs> All right, time Coach to... Coach Oleander, that mermaid tail in Mono Propulsor really worked. Oh, what's this? It's the Coach's Psycho Portal. If I could get into Lobato's head with that... I mean, that are... All right, I'm going in. Are you sure about this, darling? I'm sure this is what a Psychonaut would do. I'm inside Dr. Lobato's mind, and I'm... I'm... on a boat? Am I tied to the mast? Hey, you down there! First mate! What's going on? Why am I tied up? Is a storm coming? There's a monster lurking beneath these waves. A cursed, soulless leviathan that will never rest till it's dragged us down into the black abyss. How about we get the heck out of here, then? You think we wouldn't sail to more friendly waters if we could? Look at that compass! Gone! Lost somewhere along the way! It's enough to drive a man... to drive him! <laughs> oh, God! He's here! Not ready. Oh! Can't pick up that monster. Way too big and slippery. You think we didn't try that? That cap seems to be shock resistant, which is unusual for a shower cap. Try something else. Looks like I did some fire damage. Yes, fire! Why didn't we think of that? Okay, first mate Lobato. If Monster Bato comes back up, do that trick to slow down time again, okay? I'm going to need all the time I can get. I gotta get that helmet off of him so I can burn that shower cap. I can't pick up that monster. Way too big and slippery. What are you doing? See. Can't pick up that monster. Way too big and slippery. Dang. 
doesn't seem to be flammable there. What are you doing? Can I burn it? Oh. oh. What the? This guy is much tougher in his mind than it is. Be something. Can't pick up that monster. Way too big and slippery. Right, something else. I'm working on it. It's moving too fast. I need time to get a TK grip. TK time. But I. Where trap? Let me think now. It's moving too fast. I need time to get a TK grip. Can't pick up that monster. Way too big and slippery. We didn't try that. Can't get in his mind. That shower cap seems impenetrable. That's what I meant. Dark water. That makes me. His cap is showing. In all my days of waiting, I've never caught one of these. What is it? It's jammed shut. Fireproof. Oh, a stethoscope. I love these things. You have to keep perfectly still when you're looking at them, though, lest you get yourself seasick. I think he means stereoscope, but I don't want to ruin the moment. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Not sure what this place is, but it feels very private. I think I hit the memory mother load. Bye, son. Bye-bye. Have fun at the hospital. I know they'll take good care of you there. The procedure won't hurt a bit. We love you. Why isn't he leaving? <laughs> Just keep waving. The little monster will give up a bit. Oh my gosh. Soon we'll be free of this devil child. 
Wow. <laughs> oh, okay, so and just like most games, you can't look into it too much or you'll like lose vision or, you know, it'll just go into a black screen. So. Come in here where he can't hear us. I can't. I just can't take it anymore. He's just not natural. He's a monster. I've spoken to my colleagues at the hospital. They all agree on the diagnosis and what must be done. Will the procedure hurt him? Well, the ice pick is long, but it's very thin. And in the right hands. Oh, I don't care. I just don't care anymore. Just take him away and let this be over one way or another. Wow. Come in here and look if you don't believe me. See? Every spoon! Every spoon bent! But how do you know it was... I caught him red-handed. Except he wasn't using his hands. <sighs> okay, listen. I'll take him into the hospital with me tomorrow. Have some of the other doctors examine him. We need to be sure. After all, he is our son. Is he? Oh, will you look at our little angel? Our perfect boy. So sweet and peaceful. His whole life ahead of him. I can already tell he's going to be a doctor. Just like his old man. Or an architect. Or a lawyer. Maybe a dentist. God forbid. <laughs> hey, what's this teddy bear doing in his crib? You know, the eyes aren't child safe. Don't look at me. He must have been the cleaning lady. Wait a second. You weren't crazy. You were just more than a psychic. Holy smokes. Hey, the missing compass. So, your parents took you and they took you and, oh man. Wow. We sail for new waters! Ah, it's about time! Oh, crackers! New waters. Dr. Lobato, how are you, um, feeling? Like a cavity that's just been filled. I've done terrible things. It's not too late to set things right. 
Attention, all guards, release the patients. Bring them all here. And then swim home to your little families. There will be no more terrible experiments in this place. Great! Because I'm going to blow it to smithereens! Oh, that didn't work. A storm sequence. You've got to be kidding me. Yes. This water is coming in, darling. Raz, come help me carry my dad. Uh, I can't move right now. Warning. Let's see what we Sasha, got. let the record go. We've got to get out of here. Right Warning. after I get this scientific artifact away from this scientific abomination. Warning. Jet. There's our ticket out of here. Warning. Aha! Let me help you through this window, Harold. Warning. Harold, where are you going? The jet! I said Warning. the jet! There's Harold. I hope he doesn't fly off without us. Warning. I'm in. Time to take off and leave everyone else behind. Warning. Jeez, take a joke, Harold. Warning. Everybody come out to the jet. I don't want to let go of this water, Warning. darling, until you get that jet started up. Understood. Warning. I'll get this bird ready to fly. Warning. Yes, I know. Warning. Yes. All right, let's go back. Warning. And then let's go. I need to figure out Warning. where else I need to look. Oh. Warning. Okay, one of these must start the thing. It works! Warning. External Psylog activated. Do not attempt takeoff. What? Warning. Warning. Aha! I see the Psylog Warning. now. Psylog deactivated. The jet is cleared for takeoff. Come on, guys! Great work, darling. No, Self-destruct sequence complete. Minus ten. Come on, Truman. Nine. Let's go. Eight. Seven. Six. We did it. Five. Four. Hey, hey, guys. Three. What about me? Don't just leave me here. Two. Hey guys. One. Detonation. Oh, hey. Relax, darling. We carried your body on board along with Truman. Come on. Think we'd leave a man behind? I also carried Murmory. Sorry, I've been out of my body for a while. Of course, darling. And you were amazing. Now rest your body and your head. We're clear of the rhombus. Setting a course for Psychonauts headquarters. Dad, please wake up. I have so much to tell you. Oh. Your boyfriend? Uh-oh. So that was Psychonauts. And I am just going to throw it out there. But it was a very... Storytelling VR experience. I mean, the puzzles, eventually once you kind of catch on to it, you kind of figure your way through the game, which kind of put a short span of game length for this game, for the price of it. But yet, when you pre-ordered it, you do get the actual first game for the PS4. So that is not a bad deal. Now, I don't know if after the game you can buy it for... 
because uh, when you pre-ordered it, it was a PlayStation Plus discount of $17.99, so technically this game was $20. And for $20, if you're really a Psychonaut fan, you would definitely support them by just, you know, paying for it if you have a PlayStation VR. Other than that, for non-VR uh, people, this game will not be available for that. This is, but this is just only a prequel or a preload to Psychonauts 2. So Psychonauts 2 will not be VR supported at least, or maybe, you never know. But it's going to be a straight platform where you can actually play the game with no problems whatsoever. So. If you enjoy this video, definitely give it a like, share it with others, and if you want to see more content down the road, click the subscribe and hope to see you guys another time.